Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys don't know who I am, at, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Geraldi. I make videos all about civil life, organization, and planner videos. So if that's your type of jam, don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I'm trying to find a better place so that the sun's not hitting me so hard. Um, don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Also, click the notification bell so you do know when I do upload. And follow me on all my social media. I'm at Geraldi Silva. So today is my birthday. We're doing a birthday vlog this week or today or slip up birthday vlog i don't know how to cover myself from the sun so we're gonna have to bear it together because i'm turning 27 getting closer and closer to 30 and the more closer it gets to 30 the more i forget what my age is i think i'm 27 i don't really know and as far as today goes and like what i'm gonna do exactly for my birthday um work is one of them um you may be asking, why? Why did you decide to work on your birthday? Honestly, I don't really know. <clears throat> I should have taken the day off, and I really regret that I didn't. I get off early anyways. I get off at 1.30, so, I mean, it's not too bad. It's not like I'm stuck at work all day long. It's because I have a full set of clients. I have five clients today. Today is really, really interesting because two of those hours is one client, so she's supposed to be twice a week, or he. He or she, I don't know if it's a boy or girl. This is my first time doing a um, session with them. But um, they're supposed to be twice a week. However, the child goes to daycare. And so what mom is doing is that he's pulling him out for... or he, She's pulling him or her out for the day. And I will have to go do session with them. Leave to do another session. And then come back to do session again. And my supervisors asked me like oh is that okay and i'm like well i've never done something like that before so i guess i don't i don't know how it's gonna be i don't know if like the retention is gonna be the same once i come back if it's like useless if i come back again and like he's like over it i didn't know what to what to expect honestly so we're gonna have to figure that out once that time gets there and then um right now i'm at my first session uh it's at 8 30 it's 8 22 right now my birthday 8 22 last session i came they forgot about sessions so i'm hoping they're here today so i can do the session and then just go because if not then it's just a waste of time and i have literally nothing to do because me not me not doing session means i only get ten dollars for cancellation when i could do an hour and get paid a regular rate mm -hmm hours later it's been kind of difficult to film today just because everything's like kind of back to back um i'm already made it to my next session so this is the session where i told you guys that um i have to come back twice in one day like i said i don't know how it's gonna go because the attention span in general it's just really hard so me having to get his attention twice in one day so if it's not good the second time i'm gonna let my supervisors know and be like hey it's gonna be really difficult for me to gravitate his attention the second time because he's extremely uninterested in everything that i have because he's already played with it so there's no point in me coming back again later on oh my gosh guys my back fucking hurts i just made it to my next session i don't want to show the background just made it to my next session um i love going to this house so much because like the kid is fun like she's a little baby and she's like interesting to watch the last session that i just went to which i told you guys that i was going to go back again after i'm done with this one um it went okay however like the like i'm an energetic person like i receive vibes and energy and stuff and that place like the place that she lives in like just took out so much of my energy that i feel like i need some sort of like pick me up like i need like chocolate or something like some sort of like thing to get my energy back because to go back and do it again like i don't know something was like sucking the energy out of me me coming to this house like i feel really bad because i'm already like drained out and i want to do like i want to do a good job and i want to like present myself as a fun bubbly person to these kids because that's what they deserve except the last one just like ugh, drained my battery out and i don't know how i'm gonna make it through this hour and the next hour like i'm just thinking about like i just want to be done already and i'm like this close to being like oh i have an emergency i can't come back but no i have to do it made it this far i didn't come this far just to make it this far okay let's go get the shit from the back of my car So 
it is Wednesday today and typically on a Wednesday I always upload a video however because my birthday was yesterday I didn't get to film and I should have filmed on Monday and I didn't and I regret it so much instead of like crying <laughs> I should have been filming but yeah it's a, yesterday was my birthday it went it went pretty okay i'm gonna have more fun on saturday i'm gonna go to universal studio so i'm more excited about that and like getting to do that every single year is like my favorite thing to do anyway so today's thursday today's wednesday and like i said i usually upload a video and i wanted to upload a video today but i couldn't so most likely it'll probably be uploaded on friday just because today i'm still really busy and i won't be able to film most likely on thursday i'll be able to film and then um friday it'll go up I'm at McDonald's right now because I really wanted to get um, an iced coffee. I've already ordered it. It should be ready already. Um, I'm going to be going to my first session. I have three sessions today, so very light day. I'm I'm thinking about going home to film, but I don't know if I have enough time to go home, film, and then come back for my last session. I don't know. I'm debating it, but it's just going to... It's going to take too much time and too much gas in order to do all that. So it's better just to stay in the area because it'll be really close. So I might just go chill at Marshall's, you know. <laughs> I might just go to Marshall's. Um, so I have three sessions today. Two are back to back. The last one is like way later in the day. And my supervisor is going to be coming with me for my first two. Um, the I have one in the morning, which last week she had to cancel because she forgot session so i'm hoping today it'll work out a little bit better as far as the second session goes um mom had had complained about therapy because um i guess like the little girl she wasn't like engaged in therapy as much as she would like her to be and i thought she was targeting it targeting it towards me like the frustration like i was the one doing something wrong but my um supervisors they called her and like spoke to her they said that she really liked me it's just that she just wants the little girl to be more engaged which of course who wouldn't i would like for her to be more engaged as well but we came up with a game plan of what we could do to try to help her attention span so hopefully today goes better i need to review the notes really quickly and just see like what we had came up with because honestly i kind of forgot it's been a couple days already but i really wanted to film either it was going to be a work tote work tote bag like video or i was gonna film like my therapy crate like what's inside of my therapy like little crate that i have um and talk about like what my favorite toys are for therapy for like little ones i thought that would be like really interesting for you guys more than like what's in my work bag because i've already filmed like two videos of those but i have not done like what's in my crate bag so i might film that and i have mostly all my toys already with me so i'm thinking like what if i just like film it on like the side of the street but i feel like you guys deserve a little bit of a better production than just that <laughs> so yeah anyways i'm gonna go run in and grab my coffee and then i'm gonna head out to my session Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need got my coffee and it's like oh excuse the band-aid it's like super light which is what i like i love like creamy i can stick it in there ah! i don't know why it's always so hard it tastes so good every single time okay so i've made it here to my session i have like about two minutes left my supervisor doesn't look like he's here just yet, so I don't know when he's going to show up because the session is about to start in two minutes. I don't know if the lady's here too, because I see one car, but I think she has a minivan and it's not here. I'm going to see if she's here. If not, then I'm going to go to my next session to waste time again, so we'll see. Um, I'm interested to see because 
last so uh, this is what i'm thinking last week i had told her because she missed wednesday session again and i told her like hey we can reschedule it for friday and she's like yes friday will be a lot more better blah 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 and this this, and that so i'm thinking that maybe she thinks that our session's gonna be starting on fridays now when in reality it's like no that was just a makeup session like we didn't change our hours it was just a makeup session maybe i didn't make myself clear so i'm thinking like that's what might happen today i don't know but i have a one minute left i have to get my stuff out so i don't know where my supervisor is either okay i gotta go as suspected she wasn't there so i'm gonna go drive to this session now i only have two sessions today so i'm gonna drive to my next session should i go back home and film i just don't know if i'll have enough time to show up to the next session if i go back and film let's see how long it's gonna take me to get home so it's going to take me 10 minutes to get back home. And it's going to take me a few minutes to film. And then I will go to the next session. So I'm going to go home. I'm going to film. And then I'll go to my next session. So I can try to upload tomorrow. There's something that will have what you need. What you need. We're broken. It's tragic. We're not all elastic. But maybe there's magic. Believe you could have it. And I know of sadness. The end. You guys! Oh my god, something cool just said. I just wanted to share this just because um, it's something that's like been said for school for a really long time and I just feel so like so grown up. <laughs> you guys might think it's like the most silliest thing ever but I feel so proud of myself and so like yeah I know what I'm talking about. Anyways so I got a call I had a client yesterday. I just started session with him. I just, I had a client yesterday. And the mom had stated like, hey, the daycare like director wants to speak to you. And I'm just like, oh, okay. Like in my head, I'm thinking like, maybe probably want like some tips and techniques that they could do to like help Edward at school. They're probably having the same problem that maybe mom is having at home and whatnot. It's like, that's fine. Like I'll, I'll like talk to them or whatever. And I was like, here, here's my work number. Um, let them have me, like give me a call. And so she called today. That was, this was, the conversation I had with mom was yesterday. Today, she called me. And uh, <clears throat> she basic the director basically had stated that mom saw, like, red flags in, in the kid and saw, like, delays and stuff. And, and then that's when, like, I kind of, like, I came in and whatnot. And she also stated that mom had said, oh, I think he has autism. And she wanted to ask me if I saw anything. And then this is where, like... Or I thought back of school, like my professionalism. I was like, unfortunately, I can't disclose that with you because that is private matter between me and mom. Because in my head, I'm thinking that's a hippie violation. And I remember, I, I feel so like proud of myself because I remembered something from school. At this point, I don't remember much from school. And when I do remember something from school, I'm like, oh my God, I remember this from school. Like I. I learned something I didn't just forget everything and it makes me feel so happy about myself because I'm like I, I feel like I know what I'm doing for the longest time I felt I've had imposter syndrome and so to hear myself and to like critically think like oh like you can't do these things like you need to state these things to these people like I know what I'm supposed to be doing I know what I'm not supposed to be doing and then when I get feedback from like parents from my supervisor telling me like hey you're doing a really good job it puts me in such a a good mood and it puts me as like i am an expert i'm making a whole like video about imposter syndrome because i know we all feel that way especially when we first start or, like our big girl jobs like i'm so excited to put this video out because i put so much work into it and i really want to make it um interesting and very helpful for those who are struggling through it and I've struggled with it and then now that I'm like I still struggle with it sometimes because I sometimes I honestly I just bullshit um when I don't know what I'm doing and I'm just like trying to figure it out as I go and it's not bad that I'm trying to figure it out as I go um per se because that means I'm trying and that makes me feel good knowing that I'm trying to be the best clinician that I can be even though I may not know exactly like I'll, I'll take a client right and then let's say there's some behavioral issues or I'm trying to figure out like okay what's the best treatment that I could do that will most help this person and so that makes me feel good because it's like the good intention is there I may not know what's happening but the good intention is there so 
therefore I'm not a bad person, therefore I'm not a bad clinician, therefore I'm not a bad uh, therapist, it's because I'm trying. I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to find the information so that I could turn it into something and figure this out. And so the fact that I was able to do that today and like know that I had received information and I knew what to do with it from school, meaning like violating HIPAA violations, like what you can and can't do, what you can and can't say, and they like drilled it into us, it makes me feel good because I'm just like, okay, I know how to receive information and I know what to do with this information. And like I said, I made a whole YouTube video about it. It's going to come as the beginning of September, so please subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, <laughs> okay? It's coming and I'm so excited for you guys to see it. I'm making four different videos with four different topics about the mini this is a mini series it's called you got your first big girl job now what so it's four different parts the first one is imposter syndrome the second one is dealing with chatty gossipy co-workers the third one is how to ask for a raise when to ask for a raise and what you could do to ask for a raise and then number four is how to budget your money you got your first paycheck what do you do with it so i'm gonna be your big sister through this transition in life uh transition into careers and if you're already seasoned into speech therapy or your big girl career it's okay there's always something that we could learn so anyways i have a couple more minutes before my next session this is my last session and then i have to go home see you guys in a bit I just finished my sessions for the day. I'm gonna go run home. Gas in my car. I have zero gas. I have to go home and get ready to go to my doctor's appointment. And I should be all done for today. At least, no, actually, I need to go pick up my clothes from my mom's house. That's for sure what I need to do. I'm so excited because tomorrow's Thursday and then it's Friday and then Saturday we're going to University Studios. Woohoo! And then tomorrow I start at 9:30 which means I have an hour in the morning, which means I get to film another video. And I'm so happy filming still. So, more videos to come for you guys. And I'm gonna go home and go do the rest of my stuff. But as far as today goes, we're all done. Unless there's more speech related content later on in the day, which I doubt. So, see ya. So it's Thursday today and I have three sessions to, well, three or four, four sessions today. The one I was supposed to have um, right after my first one, she had to cancel because she's in the process of looking for a new apartment. So she's canceling today and tomorrow, which totally understandable. Right now, I'm going to go grab some coffee. The first session is literally super close to my house. So I'm going to head up over there. I'm just going to grab some coffee from McDonald's. I love the McDonald's app because you get $1 coffee no matter what the size is. And even though I don't finish a large, I get the large anyways because it's, it's all just a dollar anyways. And you never know. Maybe I'll drink more today, but I fucking doubt it. And what I like to order is the French vanilla iced coffee. And I always get... Like I said, I'm going to get diabetes, but I always get extra cream and extra vanilla syrup. We'll pick this bad boy up. Wow, there was a lot of people today at McDonald's. I don't know why there's so many people there on a Thursday morning. And a lot of kids, like, aren't you supposed to be at school? What are you doing here? Like, I'm going to work. I'm picking up coffee to go to work. Why is everybody else here? Anyways, I'm going to go to my first session. And then I get to just go back home for an hour because my, my second session canceled. And I'm thinking of whether or not I should move everybody down. But again, I just, I really don't want to. And it's only two sessions back to back. And then I'm done for the day. Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast